Take you to the water for this one right here because tonight there are new allies for Florida's manatees. A special group of girls got a chance to see the impact in Tampa Bay's Eric Glasser shows us their experience. I honestly think this is amazing. Bethany Anderson was one of about 30 girls taking part in mock manatee rescues at Zoo Tampa today. Quite awesome, actually. These Hillsborough middle schoolers are all participating in a Mission Tampa Bay STEM network program aimed at fostering interest in science, engineering, and technology. I am definitely inspired. I've always loved biology. That's just the science that I like. And this is just making me even more into it. The girls all in fifth through ninth grade got a crash course in finding, treating, and ultimately releasing their portly patient. They're gonna actually bring it over here. Then an up close and behind the scenes look and how it's done in real life. So they can learn more about like what, like some of the actions that they do that do really affect them. Inside the zoo's Manatee Critical Care Center, the girls got a rare look at the hard work and dedication it takes to protect and rehabilitate Florida's beloved sea cows. I didn't know that a lot of these animals at the zoo were like rescued animals until like I was older and it's really cool to see how they do it and I'm very appreciative of that. Even like see the changes from even from the the males over there to the ones here in the medical po in the medical pools. It's it's really cool. If you're thinking to yourself, "Wow, I'd love to participate in something like that." You can, sort of. Not quite as elaborate as the experience the girls got today, but Zoo Tampa does offer all of its visitors a chance to visit Manatee Overlook and Manatee Cove with hands-on activities, underwater viewing monitors, and a chance to meet some of the same Manatee Rescue team members who focus on saving injured, sick, and orphaned sea cows. In Tampa, Eric Glasser, 10 Tampa Bay. Big thanks to Eric.